Hello everyone, welcome to this short video on assembly and C language comparisons. So here we made two programs, one in assembly and other is in C. So first take a look on the assembly program, so in the text section we declared the text section of the program, then the declaration of main which is to be linked with underscore start function by the linker. Underscore main is the linker entry point. So first we have taken two variables, length and message, to the data and counter registers respectively. Then we copied the file descriptor 1, which is of standard output to the base register which is used as a base pointer for memory access. Now put number 4 to accumulator register, which is the system call number 4 to access the output port which is done by write API in C. Now passing 0x80 interrupt numbers so that the kernel can be invoked to execute the system call. Similarly moving 1 to accumulator which is of sys underscore exit call number. Again to execute that system call, same interrupt number is used. Now in the data section, we have taken a string the variable message. And in len, we are equating the length of the message. Now we are opening the another program which is written in C in and does the same. So in this program we are simply printing the same message. So let's compile this program using GCC compiler. In the compilation I am using an option called hyphen save, hyphen temps, and due to this option, I will be able to get the intermediate files of the compilation process in the single step. This is done to show you what happens in the C program compilation and why it is slow. So now the program is successfully compiled and we have got four new files with different extensions. Now let's assemble the assembly program using NASM assembler. So here we will write NASM, hyphen F, ELF64, hello.asm, ELF64, because I want to get an executable and linkable file on 64-bit architecture. If you are using 32-bit architecture, then no need to write 64. Now I am linking the object file using linker and I will write ld, hello.o, o, hyphen o, hello. So we have two executables named hello and a dot out. Let's do ls hyphen l to compare the executables. As you can see the size of executables, you can easily find out, which will waste more CPU cycles, and which will have more instructions to run. So now let's take look on the binaries of both the programs, you can easily see the number of instructions in the executable we got from GCC compiler. Now I am using a tool called, OBJ dump along with option hyphen capital D to disassemble the executable to show you the number of instructions to be executed and I am redirecting it to a file called hello1.txt. These are the instructions to be executed in the C code. Now let's take a look in the executable of assemble code, again I am taking the disassembly in a file called hello.txt.
These are the number of instructions to be executed in a assembly code. Now I will run both the codes. Both are same but C wastes more CPU cycles than assembly. Comment if you didn't understand something. Thank you.